hello it's me and i'm back with a new vlog finally um and yeah it's just a normal hodgepodge film clips of what i've been up to and that didn't get edited <coughs> for a week <laughs> anyway life you know first i just wanted to say that um i have a few new curated palettes up in the shop and they are actually curated by my mom and uh, she is very com competitive and she, so she goes on looking every day at which palette has sold the most hers or mine just to keep the family peace before christmas if you go onto the shop please choose one of these just so my mom gets happy <laughs> just kidding anyway um but yeah let's head out straight into the rest of the vlog If you can hear me over the the heater but it's so bloody cold and I think everybody right now is trying to save on electricity so I try to like put the temperature temperature down during the during the night um, but it was really cold when I got it out here today um, and as you can look at you're like oh it's still night no no I got home at 3 and it was getting dark. It is 4 now so I've had lunch and it's pitch black. We're going to make some paint while I'm still up and going. And then I think I will head in and have a hot bath. So I defrost. <laughs> no, I should not complain. I should not complain. It's good. But I realised the paint we're going to make, we're going to make arsenic. And arsenic, I have not printed out the recipe in my binder. Should I do that? Like, if that, that takes so long, you know. I should just sit down and update my recipe binder, but now we should just get started, I suppose. Okay, da. Oh, she. Oh, okay. Yes. Yeah, so, this plant has been standing over my computer out in the office, but it looks really sad. So I'm thinking, if I place it right here next to you, maybe it will feel better. Because I, I sure hope so. <laughs> Let's put you 
next to my really sad other plant. So, yes, this will be perfect. <laughs> okay, oh god. Yeah, that, that always happens. So everybody knows what kind of paint I've been making. It's fine. Okay, so I've been sitting down at my desk and I'm pretty tired. The, the darkness just does not help, but it's the same thing every year. Every year we complain about it and how surprised we are about how dark it is. It's the same thing every year. Like, the, the coldness, the weather change, but never the light. The light is always constantly gone. <laughs> and we're still surprised. Anyway. So, I have made myself my cup of... Should we taste it? I'm really... That tasted like nothing. Anyway, so I was at a new shop today on my way home and um, first I got a few things but the things I want to show you are just so funny. I think they're really funny anyway. Uh, let's do that, that's what I need to work on. Um, so I got this makeup palette from I Heart A Revolution and it's the donkey from Shrek. They had like um, the other characters too, but I just felt like this was so funny. Um, so I left it inside, but I mean, just the packaging, I love it. And then it says here on the side, I think it's so funny. Uh, obviously, uh, me and my coworker, we are both big Shrek fans. Uh, <laughs> And uh, we really wanted a one with And in the morning, I made that was out. And I just could not help myself because I have no self-control. Uh, also, I just really love packaging. I don't know if it is that you just like packaging from an aesthetic point of view. Or because I want to have packaging, you know. So I'm, I'm saving the packaging. I have quite a pile of packaging that I really like. Um, speaking of makeup, Colourpop, which is an American brand, I bought a few things from them uh, and they have amazing packaging so yeah just anyway and then they also had these Terry's chocolate in a few different ones I have not seen them in Sweden before so had to get one chocolate and oranges are just like made to be consumed together now I know my friend from school she would like Never. She hated it. But I really like it. So, anyway. Uh, while I am having a little bit of a break, well, I, I have made the things I need to make today. Um, I mentioned before that I got the Hobie Advent Calendar. And the first Advent, or the first, um, the first box, had some uh, cotton yarn and some patterns to make, some ornaments. I was not a big fan, but I'm just going to place the yarn in my stash. I now have a yarn stash, which feels really weird. Um, and I'll do something else with them. Now, uh, this Sunday, and it was two rolls of yarn for two skeins. Uh, it was a red ribbon um, yarn and also a gold lame. So, and they suggested to make baskets, so I have actually done that. So here is the first one. Why I have brought them out is because I need to weave in like all the ends, but I think they turned out really cute. So this one is the first one I made and it was still enough yarn, so I just um, carried on. So I made another one. And I'm, I'm just, uh, I totally experimented with this one. I didn't follow any pattern because uh, I'm not very good at it. <laughs> You'd think it would be helpful when you're a beginner. Um, but yeah, I just, I tried to use as much of this gold as possible, but it was so annoying to work with. So anyway, uh, yeah. So I still have a little bit of this red one. I think you have like, two, a half, one and a half to two meters maybe. Um, so I'm just going to cut that, cut that off. 
and use it for packaging like stuff now for Christmas. Um, and this will go into my stash. And I have these little baskets. I think they turn out really cute. And now I want to make all the baskets in all the different colours. <laughs> but it does, this, this went so quickly. Like you just make this round and then crochet up. And I think this one took me like one and a half, two, two and a half hours. Two and a half hours. Yeah, let's say that. I just made it um, one evening I made a bottom and then yesterday before work when I was having breakfast or well, I wasn't having breakfast I had, had my breakfast and then I was working a bit on this so yeah I'm, I'm really happy I'm not sure what to actually push in them but I think it would be a really fun idea to place stuff in it and give it like a, a gift basket for Christmas you know um so that's my my idea i think they turned out really cute um so yeah okay so i decided on my next project it's um going to be more crochet and i have this really chunky i think it's actually made for doing macrame um i don't know how you say it in english but i'm too tired to find out you know when you tie things so I'm going to make a basket out of that um, recently over Black Friday <laughs> I bought a whole bunch of these um, pastel color cotton yarns so I'm thinking I can make like a little basket to put them all in and also I'm just really tired and I have like a drawing project I would like to do but my hands are not functioning in a detailed way so I can still do something even though I can't do what I would love to do you know but I think it will be fine anyway um, so yeah I'm just going to keep on keeping on it's tomorrow obviously um, and uh, I'm just procrastinating a little bit of going out. I'm, I'm working in the studio today. It's been snowing quite a lot. Well, not no, that's an exaggeration. It's just about white. It's not snowing a lot. Um, but it's enough for my hips to be like squeaking. So we are just... We are just staying in <laughs> like that. And I have another one. She is so graceful, so ladylike. Um, and I continue to work on my basket. But I ran out of, of the yarn. <laughs> so, um, yeah, today my plan is to I have some computer work I need to done to do. I have some computer work to do. Also some photographing that I have should have done like sand Sunday. But the thing is because um smooth um I need some light to photograph stuff so they don't get like grainy. So I'm really should do that first to make sure it gets done. Because this is the first time I've been home and it's been light. Um, now I have pretty good lights in the studio or in the workshop. But yeah. Anyway, that's just one of the things with, um, with, with living like this. Light is an issue. So I'm going to do that hopefully to make a batch of paint. Because I'm saying hopefully because today I also have... I'm meeting with the accountant for the end of the year wrap up of the bookkeeping. You need to do that once a year. And we're doing that today. So I need to know how the finances are going, I suppose. Uh, if I could have it my way, I would not know. <laughs> Which is not very businesslike. should not be like that. But... 
anyway so i'm doing that and that's like middle of the day appointment so i'm not sure if i'm going to have lunch before or after or you know big issues here anyway so i need to remember to do that so maybe it's not so smart to do paint before and get all messy should probably come to that meeting clean and looking professional yeah anyway maybe i should bring her first we need to go and check on the little birds oh god let's see i did hear some squeaking but i think that was over albert albert he can't pick it up because it's too cold so he can't carry it it's so funny yeah okay is it too cold okay anyway uh i have some old pears i've chopped up to give to little chicken They got a new type of um, bedding, and apparently it was very exciting. <laughs> uh, okay. Come on. Come on. Hey. Are you laying eggs? Do you want to try this? Oh, Vera. Yeah? Can you try some pears? Do you want me to open? Open the door. Do you want to go out? It doesn't look like it. Uh, the pair was a hit anyway. Let's see here. Pull the string. Oh, it's frozen. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah. You do want to go out. Sometimes it's bolted from the outside and sometimes it's not. It is, okay. It's coming from the other side. You can't need to pick up on me. Okay. Can you eat from that? Yeah, yeah, I got it. Jesus. Oh, that's good girls. Okay. No, you, it needs to be really shut because the light brown one, that one, she escapes every time. I mean, okay, so it is colder, obviously, um, with the snow, but there is a different type of light, which is really lovely. So... I have to be glad for the small things, you know? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Ooh, and here we go. Good morning. Do you want to go out? <laughs> Doesn't look like it. <laughs> like, no, bad idea. Yeah, I know. I know. Yeah, the boys can't go out until the girls are out, apparently. So. Okay, back to the workshop. I'm not going to stay out here. No. -uh. I'll bet. Todan. Come here. Come, come, come. switching foot gear <laughs> let's see i'm going to bring you the because i have computer work to do okay ignore <laughs> everything i suppose so i was filming on this one yesterday so i'm going to 
bring this one and we'll see if we can cobble together what we have filmed and right now i'm trying just to get videos out as best as i can these are what i need to do and photograph i also have some palettes here so anyway i'm going to get to work so i get some stuff done <laughs> and i'll get back to you later thank you so much for watching this vlog i hope you have enjoyed it it has been quite busy now leading up to the holidays and I have quite a lot of stuff booked in in the in between days so we'll see <laughs> we'll see how it goes my my really good intention of getting a new schedule or a new routine has gone so so but you know life and i hope you <laughs> i hope you enjoy uh seeing other things too anyway uh the vlogs will obviously continue just sporadically i uh, hope you have enjoyed them there is a shop update in the beginning of january so keep your eyes out for that newsletter will be coming out and until then i hope you have the best of holidays and just taking care of each other so bye